want y'all to keep supporting my girl, you feel me? If anything happened to me, keep the fuck niggas away from her, you feel me? No be sliding in her DM. Because I'm haunt y'all niggas, you feel me? And I'm haunt you too. <laughs> Yeah, man, just keep support. I want y'all to support Holly, man. Run her shit up. Go follow her on Instagram. What's your Instagram? Damn, it's Holly. Yeah, go follow her on Instagram. Damn, it's Holly. Turn her shit all the way up. It's a crazy world. One day you're good, the next day you're not. Mm hmm. That's why y'all gotta go to the doctor. Are you gonna tell them exactly what's wrong, baby? You know that booty ass. Yeah, I gotta have heart surgery and they gotta repair my aorta. It's like a um a tear down my whole, the whole aorta. So it's like. They gotta go in and repair the top part first, and then they gotta go back in for a second surgery and repair the, the rest of it. Um, yeah, man, I don't know. Y'all know I ain't no talkative ass motherfucker, you hear me? So I don't be talking too much. I don't be doing all that red rare, you hear me? Get in your feelings type shit. But I guess I just wanted to holler at y'all one more time, you hear me? But I'm probably gonna holler at y'all again, maybe. Yeah, yeah, let's not. But I'm just saying, though, like, you know what I'm saying? The shit, the shit getting real, man. <laughs> Niggas young as hell, like, you feel me, having multiple heart surgeries. And it's not because motherfuckers is doing drugs. I don't want y'all to think that I was doing drugs, and I don't want y'all to be doing drugs and shit. I was born with a condition, you feel me? A heart condition already, so I, now this shit is, I don't know, this shit's stirring up again and shit. I don't know. So don't think like, oh yeah, man, that nigga has died, man. No, what, what that? You feel me? Motherfuckers just was made this way. Hey, you know what's so crazy though? The craziest part is that for the people who really like stuck around, um, we talked about this before. Yeah. It was like we uh we talked about this on the channel before, but we kind of didn't know. And I was saying this like, you know, I was kind of saying like, I'd be worried or whatever, and then it'd be like, we don't be taking this serious, and it's crazy that the day came that it's here. Oh my I don't know what to do or know what to say. I just, I kind of feel sad, but I'm trying not to feel sad because I don't want you to feel sad. I feel like it's really kind of fucked up because it's like, I feel like I don't know how to comfort you. So it's kind of like the, you know how people just be like, oh, it's going to be okay. It's going to be okay. And I know you were saying like, be realistic, but it's like, what do you say? You know, I guess I just want you to go into it with a positive spirit. Yeah. I feel like it ain't nothing to say though. There's nothing you can say because yeah. I feel like, I don't know, I just be feeling like everybody else on the outside looking in. They be like, you gonna be good, you gonna be good. But what if I don't be good? Like, you feel me? What if I'm not good? It's just like, you feel me? I love you though, baby. I don't want you to be worried and shit. You feel me? You don't be crying, shady. You just gotta do what you gotta do, you know what I mean? Without the kid. I did no, have his last surgery August 16th. Everything was good. You know, he kind of like, uh, I think he came home maybe a week and a half after surgery. I don't think it was a full two weeks. It might have been a week and a half after surgery. And, um, you know, he was just doing fine. He was in recovery. Um, he was recovering at home. And y'all, just September 6th, that night, he just, he woke up. And in the middle of the night, we had just went to sleep not too long before everything happened. And, yeah. So, I just wanted to clear that up. Like, S. Dot, his surgery was successful. His surgery was successful. You know, as far as we know, everything was good. He was fine. He was up. He was moving. And uh, he passed away at home. This was after the surgery. He passed away at home. And so, um, I just wanted to get that clear because I know a lot of, like, sources and stuff was just saying that he died from which they could not be wrong you know like technically using terms like that from complication of surgery it could have been you know we don't really know all the way like but for the most part his surgery was successful and